What is up? It is Dallas Sleep here coming at y'all with another video. Today's video, we are at a private event here at Lamborghini Dallas for the unveiling of a customer car. Got some pretty special cars attending the event. Now, this is my second time seeing this car, this time in a bit of overcast. Nonetheless, check this spec out. Of course, got the details, like the blue on the wing, the body written right there, and then, of course, the engine. Uh, covers right there in blue as well check that spec out and of course the brand new 4 gt carbon series absolutely stunning and of course the 4 gt carbon series here now every carbon series is done in ex full exposed gloss carbon fiber see that it's pretty much everywhere we got the v6 engine for the 4gt and then there's that interior view i really love how the 4gt kind of has like that futuristic wheel and of course very minimal uh, buttons and toggles for the center console and of course this spec also features red accenting through the mirrors and then the wheels are right there with the red brake calipers this is a gorgeous gorgeous spec the owner just got it he actually has put it kind of in the race mode if you will for ford so super nice to see it with the wing up and lowered. And of course, with the 4GT, you also can get these carbon fiber wheels, which are an awesome touch. Nonetheless, check these two out. This is quite the pairing to see on a Saturday morning. Check this out. So I have to kind of switch sides here. You guys can see that carbon fiber thread so nicely done on this car. I've actually seen one other carbon fiber, our fully exposed carbon fiber GT, uh, in other words, the carbon series. These are extremely cool to see, but that car is magnificent in its own glory. Nonetheless, I love with the GT as well. You kind of get these um, fluorescent headlights here with the GT inside of them, um, or GT, I should say. And this headlight design, if you guys look really close, it does pay heritage back to the older GTs with the kind of shaping and form. And of course, the GT, the newer GTs, at least, to kind of get this iconic um, vintage right here which really helps with the airflow and such nonetheless check this thing out and of course this nice hole right here that helps with air passing through the back this is just phenomenal oh man Technic has been taken out of the showroom. Check this out. So it's a matte black paint. There's the interior there. Black Alcantara with yellow inserts. Super clean. Now the Technic will obviously get this more open rear end so you can kind of see the tires a bit more. Just got done at Lamborghini Dallas. Now we're gonna head over to the second location where we may see some more cars. So we are at Tight End Sports Bar and Grill in Plano. 
where once again we have the usual culprits. And the new Technicas arrived too, appropriately. Check out that matte black. Pretty insane ghost coming through as well. Check oh, those brake helmets cool. out. Yeah, that's what it is. My god. This is a blue pinch tracking as well, super clean. Got Michael here in his chromed out Aventador SVJ. This is a bit silly looking, but I guess there's quite a few Lamborghinis here with the interesting finishes, so check this thing out. This is originally Narrow Nemesis and now it is wrapped in chrome pink. And it is loud as hell. action going here and then looks like the purse sport's getting ready for the little stunt that's about to go down so this will be quite interesting to uh, witness and while we're here we might as well check out this lamborghini huracan st this one is from underground racing as you guys can tell twin turboed i do not know how much horsepower this is pushing but sto's are naturally from the factory powerful and then when you throw the underground racing stuff on it i am sure it just turns into hell of course you can see it has some hre wheels too pretty cool pretty cool got the carbon fiber wing and this STO kind of, with the STO design, you kind of get this open area here with the vents, and then of course this nice translation into the rear wing. But let's uh, see what fuckery is going down right over here. So you guys can kind of guess what's about to go down here. Um, yeah. That's, yeah. First, first sport. Jumped by kid on two. Scooter jump over a Sean Purse Ford and a Carbon Series GT right here, around $7 million all in all. This is a bit silly. Oh my. Kind of see the light blue accenting in there. It's kind of on the grill too. You can't really tell. Um, headliner in there is also that light blue, and then of course these brake calipers are that kind of tealish blue. And then this nice pinstripe that runs alongside the car. And then from what I've heard, this is a uh, Mansory wing or spoiler on the back, which is pretty neat. Properly Montana plated, of course. And the one thing I also love about this car is the wheels. Super nice wheels. I do not know what the size are, but can assume pretty big and you can kind of see the pinstripe it continues it continues and then it kind of breaks up right here into this little pattern which is pretty pretty cool so yeah love this here's a better look at that gt carbon series for you guys in the sunlight you can really see the weave a lot better check that out this little shot of the engine bay and of course the interior here pretty uh, basic nothing too impressive toggles aren't really like that modernized or anything it's just you know the basics that you need in an interior with a car like the gt pretty cool though i do love the spec it is probably one of my favorites i've seen besides the other carbon series that i got to see at the peterson in california so yeah and there's a little shot of the wheels as well which are also appropriate carbon fiber too Lineup. And I've already filmed these cars so many times, but it's just magnificent to see them under the sun. Of course, got the color matched French blue cone. Now, originally, I did say this is Atlantic blue, but it's actually French blue. So, everything on this car is French blue matched. So, from the engine covers there to the lettering here to obviously things like the Instagram there are all French blue based. So, this is pretty cool 
see out here. Check this out. Lovely pair of cars. Got the GT leave in here. Check out how low this thing gets in race mode, as I would like to call it. What a cool, cool car. Love that. Next to the Chiron, of course. Beautiful, beautiful car. Check that out. And there he goes. Alright guys, got a 50th anniversary Roadster rolling in here. Check this thing out. Wrapped in everything. Wow. Look at that blue. Pearlescent. That thing is neat. Oh my god. Alright guys, and to close the video off, I decided to park my car next to the Chiron. 